here's a story for you. It's a positive Pitbull story, but it has a sad ending. Here it goes. Pitbull saves two women from deadly cobra. Dies wagging its tail. The children in the Fronteras household referred to their dog as Kuya, big brother, and he certainly proved it on the day he sacrificed his life to protect the family. Chief, an American Pitbull Terrier, rescued um, the grandmother and the granddaughter, Maria Victoria, from a deadly cobra which had entered their house through the opening in the kitchen. Uh, they had been watching TV on the sofa when suddenly Chief jumped up and alerted her to the presence of a cobra less than 10 feet away. Maria Victoria rushed in and pulled her grandmother into a separate room, hoping the snake would leave. But when uh, Maria later emerged from the room, she was terrified to find the cobra was poised about two feet away. Equally startled, the cobra expanded its hood and appeared to be spitting venom as it prepared to strike. The snake was in front of us, maneuvering a deadly attack. That's when she screamed out loud and asking for help. Now, I love this. That's when, from, quote, out of nowhere, end quotes, you gotta love those quotes, out from nowhere, Chief dashed between the cobra and the two women, using himself as a shield against the cobra's attacks. Chief then seized the cobra by the neck and slammed it to the floor, killing it. But for Chief... It was a victory. In the struggle, he sustained a fatal bite to the jaw, and moments later, he began gasping for breath. The family saw a vet, but they were told nothing could be done because the bite was too close to the chief's brain, and the venom had already started to spread. Um, Maria called her husband, Marlone, who rushed home immediately. Uh, 30 minutes after the bite, Chief had been uh, wobbly and lost control. Um, it wasn't until Marlone arrived that Chief finally let go. Chief gave his two deep breaths and died. He was fighting and saving his last ounces of breath to see a glimpse of his master for the last two seconds of his life. Ian adds that the last thing Chief did as he gazed up was wag his tail. That's just how pits are.